As we continue to navigate through this pandemic, public health experts remind us you can still come down with COVID-19 despite being fully vaccinated. ABC Action News reporter Mary O'Connell shares what we know about breakthrough cases and what steps you can take to help protect yourself. As the pandemic stretches on, the term breakthrough infection may come to mind. Maricel St. Clair is all too familiar. I woke up feeling a little sinus pressure in my nose here and a very slight headache. And I thought, well, gosh, it's allergies. St. Clair says she was vaccinated against COVID-19 in April. But in August, I tested myself in the morning, not thinking for a second I would be positive, and it just lit up, and I was astonished. I could not believe that I was positive for COVID. According to the CDC, a vaccine breakthrough infection happens when a fully vaccinated person gets infected with COVID-19. I spoke to BayCare's chief medical officer, Dr. Nishant Anand, about these cases. When you look at total infections right now that are uh, people developing COVID, only 1.5% up to about 2% in our communities actually break through infections, which means that's pretty darn good. The majority of people who are getting infected right now are unvaccinated. The CDC says there's evidence that vaccination may make illness less severe for those who are vaccinated and still get sick. Dr. Anand explained breakthrough infections will tend to happen more when COVID is more rampant in your community and shared with me why getting the vaccine is still important. Unvaccinated people are four and a half times more likely to get infected. They're 10 times more likely to end up in the hospital, 11 times more likely to die from COVID-19. Health experts say everyone can increase their chances of avoiding a breakthrough by taking steps like masking up and social distancing. While St. Clair's case was mild, she shares this message to the community. We still need to be vigilant out there in the community when we're going about our daily life to be extra careful. In Tampa, Mary O'Connell, ABC Action News.